Hello everyone, welcome to the lesson on how to draw and design a car. So today I'm going to show you how to draw this particular car. And just like every other lesson I show with drawing, it's all about, you know, planning and going through the steps. So this is just an example here that I drew and just kind of wrote out the steps. But what I'm going to do right now is um, just take a pencil first. I'm going to make a line that shows the bottom of the car. Now this line that I'm drawing up here is going to indicate where kind of like the, the hood of the car is going to go to. And I'll show you in a, in a few steps how we'll get started. So just a little bit above the line, we're going to go like this and make this shape. I'll just stop when I get to the line here. That is going to represent the front bumper and the hood. Now we're going to draw the roof of the car, kind of round it off to make it streamlined. For all those great six science students and then on the back here we're going to make a rear bumper and stop there I'm going to now grab my pencil and i'm going to put another line going across here it's not halfway it's actually a little bit more than halfway going towards the uh, roof or the hood and i'm going to draw some semicircles here so kind of half of a circle going like this and then going across, stopping here and doing another circle up to that pencil line or semicircle. And that's where our wheels are going to go in. So inside that, we're going to draw some circles that go now down to the pencil line. Because that now represents the bottom of the car where the wheels are going to be the furthest part at the bottom. We're now going to put a little bit of detail inside each tire, so an extra circle. And then I'll just put some detail inside here, which is called a hubcap. You can do whatever you like inside of your wheels. I'll just put a little bit of extra detail in here. And I'm sure with any other drawing lesson, if you want to pause, you can always pause to see if you're doing these steps properly. And then right here, I'm just going to put little circles, which in, indicates kind of like the the um, the, uh, the screws or the yeah, the uh, the bolts that go inside the hubcap. There, we're not going to do the side window. Notice I'm not going to go a straight line. I'm going to kind of curve the line a little bit. These cars are all about streamlining, which means everything is kind of rounded so the air can go smoothly around it. Right here, I'm going to put in a few lines to indicate the door. And this just divides the two windows up on the side. I put a couple lines in here to show that the wheels are inside that section. And I'll show how to shade that a little bit later. Now I'm going to put a few lines on the car just for some details. So that's the line for the bumper. That's just like a little light. And then I put another line here. And then what's called a headlight in the front. This is the hood of the car. We're now going to put the windshield, which is the front window. And then here I'm just going to put a little line and then an extra section here to show the rear window, back window. Of course, you need to get into the door, so let's put the door handle and a rear view mirror. We're now going to put some details towards the back of the car. 
So we'll put a line here to indicate kind of like the, the trunk. Here we'll put the line for the bumper, the back bumper. Extra line in here. The back light. And then just a little extra kind of line here. Now in the back of the car, we're going to make this kind of like a sports car. So this is called a spoiler. And there again, if you're one of my grade six students, this is something that um, it's for fast cars to kind of use Bernoulli's principle with the high pressure push, pushing down on it so that it keeps the back uh, down. I'm going to erase these lines now here as we now have the drawing of the car. We don't need the pencil lines. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my Sharpie and I always like to just um, darken up some of the lines as I draw just to kind of thicken up those lines to make it uh, more visible and I'm just going to time lapse this here, darken up all these lines. Then there's going to be areas in the car that's going to be dark. I'm just going to color in the windows. doing the hatching, which is a drawing art style of creating your value and your shadows by just putting parallel lines. It's called hatching. And then once you're done with that, you're going to um, get some color. Put some color to color your vehicle. And because it's kind of like a design lesson, you know, you can label different parts. Like here, I just make it look fancy by labeling, you know, headlight and door handle and spoiler and then name my vehicle. So I hope you had fun in that lesson and I will see you soon. Bye, guys.